So now we are going to solve the bar graph. Sorry, now we are going to see the bar graph that is handling data. The topic is so heading is exercise choices of fitness club members. This is the title. So title always comes under in x axis. Okay, so x axis is that means sorry. Uh, I'll repeat once again handling data is a topic name. So now we are going to what uh, draw the uh, bar graph first we have to know how we are going to draw the uh, bar graph. So what are the uh, what what are the benefits of bar graph means it is clearly understand the what information uh, it is clearly understand the what information to the students or to the people. It represent very clearly with the help of the bar graph it represent the information very clearly we can easily understand the information that is a basic uh, basic uh, use of bar graph so now we are going to see exercise exercise choices of fitness club members this is the title and also uh, now we are going to uh, see how many people choose uh, different kind of exercises they have uh, many people uh, choose different kind of exercises especially in the club members in this club members um, in this club many people are joined many people are joined to get, join in this club so they want to maintain the fitness so they have choose different kind of exercises now we are going to see what are the exercises they have chosen first one is walking next one is aerobic so walking i shaded in brown color and aerobics it is an orange color and yoga it is in yellow color and swimming it is in pink color and tennis it is in green color i just want to what uh, show the difference of different exercises that is what i given different different colors now so walking it is in ex what are the exercises they have chosen by the people what are the exercises chosen by the people i have taken an x axis so exercises i have taken an x axis and number of people i have taken in y axis so x axis and y axis combined together as a label combined together as a label because we have given the what label label means is a name so x axis means x exercises y axis mean number of people i'll repeat once again x axis mean exercises what are the exercises chosen by the people that is walking aerobics yoga swimming and tennis this is the um, these are the exercises so i've taken the x axis and it is in horizontal line next y axis mean number of people so number of people i have taken in y axis it is in vertical line so uh, x axis and y axis combined together as a label and exercise choices of fitness club members it is a title so and also x axis 1 cm is equal to it is x axis 1 cm is equal to what is this x axis we have taken exercises so here y axis 1 y axis 1 cm is equal to what that is 2 unit 2 unit so each square is what each square is 2 units this is 0 2 4 so each square is each unit is 2 unit uh, each that is each that is each square is 2 unit that is called 2 centi 1 cent 1 this y axis 1 cm is equal to 2 unit y axis 1 cm is equal to 2 unit that means each square is called as a what 2 unit that is year 2 unit year 2 unit that is 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 so y axis 1 cm is equal to 2 unit and x axis we have taken x axis as a exercises so this this is 0 and this is 1 and this is 2 and this is 3 and this is what 4 so this is that is 1 to 2 it is what 1 unit it is what 1 unit so I just give the space because of uh, uh, what um, it if you give some space only it clearly what represent the uh, what clearly represent the what paragraph and looks very nice to see there is no confusion here. So uh, first we have to start with x axis x axis so we have to draw the bar graph uh, from the x axis to y axis from the x axis to y axis so walking walking uh, that means how many people choose that is 16 people 16 people choose walking so from the x axis to y axis we have to draw so walking in x axis and 16 that is y axis number of people in y axis so 16 people 
choose walking so i have draw the vertical bar vert, vertical what vertical means this is called as a vertical so vertical bar graph vertical bar graph i have i have drawn vertical bar graph i have drawn and shaded in brown color next then uh, how many people choose aerobics that means how many people that is eight people choose aerobic so it is it is also draw from the x axis to y axis so aerobics in x axis and eight people up to eight people from from x axis from x axis to eight so from x axis to y axis that means aerobics to eight people in aerobics it is taken in x axis and eight is what is how many people's number of people is eight so it is from x axis to y axis i have drawn the bar graph it is also vertical bar graph i shaded in orange color next how many people uh, choose yoga means that is 13 people that is 12 to 14 these two it is these uh, each square i told you two uh, two two unit each square is 2 unit that is called as 1 cm is equal to 2 unit that is uh, each square is 2 unit so in the middle of the 12 to 14 uh, that is that means 13 this is called as 13 this is called as 13 so 13 cm uh, sorry 13 people sorry 13 people so from x axis to y axis I have drawn the vertical bar graph so I just want to give a different color so yoha I have taken what yellow color I shaded in yellow color so 13 people choose yoga I will repeat once again walking 16 people from x axis to y axis i have drawn the vertical bar graph it is uh, in brown color i shaded in brown color and also aerobics totally eight people choose so i shaded in orange color and yoga 13 people choose so i shaded in yellow color from x axis to y axis i have drawn a vertical bar graph here yeah, swimming so from x axis to y axis here also eight so that is that means aerobics and swimming both are equal both are choose by equal people equal members so aerobic and swimming um, swimming both are same so eight people aerobic and swimming both are same equal member of people equal number of people choose this uh, exercises choose this exercise that means aerobic and swimming that eight people choose aerobic as well as swimming so eight people choose aerobics and swimming so i've drawn the bar graph that vertical bar graph from x axis to y axis here also what here also eight people so that is what swimming is number of people is what eight so i shaded in pink color then last is tennis tennis means so you know that it is also one kind of exercise uh, it helps to fitness so uh, you know that the, all the exercise only for the fitness so from x axis to y axis so tennis i shaded in green color because i want to uh, clear explanation and uh, to represent the diagram is very colorful and also um, what it looks attractive and also if you uh, give different color only uh, we have to uh, get the clear idea and clear information so then and and, and and also it is different uh, different exercises in different color that means it look nice to see then tennis that means what is this how many people that means uh, 12 people tennis 12 people so from x axis to y axis 12 people and chosen 12 people has chosen tennis so 12 people has chosen tennis um, that is um, so 12 people's tennis 12 people's swimming eight people and yoga that is 13 people and what is this aerobics eight people again and walking this is the what 16 people so i write it here 16 walking aerobics eight aerobics eight yoga it is what 13 and swimming it is also eight and tennis it is 12 so totally so these are the these are the number of people choose different different exercises the question is given here which is the tallest bar which is the tallest bar that is what is this walking is the tallest bar so answer is walking number of people 13 people so it is additional information next which bar is equal in height that means which bar is equal in height it is what is this aerobic and swimming both are in equal height so number of people aerobics eight people and also swimming also eight people so that is swimming even first you write aerobics aerobics and swimming so number of people 
How many people? Eight people. Next, that is how many people choose yoga? That is 13 people. Answer is 13 people. I shade in yellow color. So, how many people choose yoga means? You know that the bar graph represents very clearly 13 people. This is the middle of 12 to 14. So, in the middle line is what? Middle line represents 13 people choose what? Yoga. So, now I think so you understand very clearly. Now you understand very clearly the bar graph. 